Curious to know the top-rated Korean series of all time on cable TV? If you're looking for new shows to watch, this video can also give you leads on the K-dramas that you should get started on. The list is based on each show's average nationwide TV ratings as per Nielsen Korea, updated as of May 30, 2020. So, here are the top 20 highest rating Korean dramas of all time that aired on cable TV. 20. Familiar Wife. A romantic fantasy drama starring Ji Sung, Han Ji Min, Jang Sung Jo, and Kong Han Na. It aired on TVN from August 1st to September 20th, 2018. With an average nationwide rating of 6.8%. The series follows a married couple which suddenly finds themselves living entirely different lives, after their fates magically change through an unexpected incident. 19. Another Miss O. Oh. Aired on TVN from May 2 to June 28, 2016, with an average nationwide rating of 6.9%. This 16-episode fantasy rom-com involves a long game of mistaken identity. Two women both named Oh Hae Young continually cause confusion in their respective jobs and relationships as they somehow always get entangled in each other's lives. 18. Reply 1994. The series follows six university students all residing in one boarding house in Seoul, which is run by a couple with a daughter named Sung Na Young. While experiencing various cultural Korean milestones together, these seven strangers soon learn to treat each other like family. It aired on TVN from October 18 to December 28, 2013. With an average nationwide rating of 7.4%. 17. What's Wrong with Secretary Kim? The series aired on TVN from June 6 to July 26, 2018, with average rating of 7.45%. The plot revolves around the ambitious vice chairman of a major corporation, and his highly capable secretary. Misunderstandings arise when she announces that she will resign from her position after working for nine years. 16. Prison Playbook. A captivating drama revolving around the life of a superstar baseball pitcher who is convicted of assault after he saves his sister from a sexual attack. It aired on TVN from November 22, 2017, to January 18, 2018. The series garnered an average rating of 7.6%. 15. Strong Woman Do Bong Soon. Starring Park Bo Young in the title role as a woman with superhuman strength, with Park Hung Sik and Ji Soo. It aired on JTBC from February 24 to April 15, 2017, with an average nationwide rating of 7.65%. 14. The Crowned Clown. The series centers on the tale of a Joseon king and his doppelganger, a clown whom he desperately puts on the throne to escape the intense power struggles afflicting the royal court and the royal family. It aired from January 7 to March 4, 2019 on TVN, which garnered an average nationwide rating of 8.41%. 13. Memories of the Alhambra. A romantic fantasy series starring Yun Bin and Park Shin Hai. The series centers on a company CEO and a hostile owner who get entangled in a series of mysterious incidents surrounding a new and intricate augmented reality game. The drama garnered an average nationwide rating of 8.43%. 12. Encounter. A romantic melodrama starring Song Hai Kyo and Park Bo Gum. It aired on TVN from November 28, 2018 to January 24, 2019, brought together by fate, a woman who seems to have everything and a young man who seems to have nothing, decide to give up an ordinary life to be together. The series was a commercial success with an average nationwide rating of 8.5%. 11. Signal. It premiered on TVN on January 22, 2016, with the final episode aired on March 12, 2016. The series follows police lieutenant and criminal profiler who gets hold of a special walkie-talkie that can communicate with people from the past, he joins forces with a detective in 1989 to solve three decades of related murders. The series garnered an average nationwide rating of 8.8%. 10. Hotel Del Luna. The series follows Jang Manuel as the CEO of Hotel Del Luna, who is cursed to run the establishment for all of eternity as punishment for a sin she can't remember. The only way to free herself from her penance is to find someone who's committed a crime far worse than hers. 
It aired on TVN from July 13 to September 1, 2019. With an average nationwide rating of 8.9%. 9, 100 Days My Prince. It aired on TVN starting from September 10 to October 30, 2018. The drama tells a story of a crown prince suffering from amnesia, who ends up in the care of Hong Shim, an intelligent but unmarried woman. Thinking of himself to be a commoner, he weds Hong Shim to save her from being punished by a law that he himself established as a prince. The drama was a hit and recorded an average rating of 9.0%. 8. Hospital Playlist. The series stars Jo Young Suk, Yoo Yeon Sook, Yoon Kyung Ho, Kim Dae Myung and Jaeon M. I. Do. The first season aired on TVN from March 12 to May 28, 2020. Hospital Playlist tells the story of five doctors who have been friends since they entered medical school in 1999. It garnered an average nationwide ratings of 9.9%. 7. Itaewon Class. It aired on JTBC in Korea from January 31 to March 21, 2020 and is streaming worldwide on Netflix. Starring Park Seo Joon, Kim Da Mi, Kwon Nara and An Bo Yun. Itaewon Class tells the story of ex-convict whose life has been turned upside down after he gets expelled from school for punching a bully and his father is killed in an accident. The drama was a hit with an average rating of 11.8%. 6. Crash Landing on You. It is about a South Korean woman who accidentally crash lands in North Korea, starring Yun Bin and Sun Yi Jin. It aired on TVN in South Korea and on Netflix worldwide from December 14, 2019, to February 16, 2020. It is the highest rated TVN drama which recorded an average nationwide rating of 12.2%. 5. Reply 1988. Set in the year 1988, it revolves around five friends and their families living in the same neighborhood of Sangman Dong, Dabong District, Northern Seoul. It aired from November 6, 2015, to January 16, 2016, on TVN for 20 episodes. It received both critical and audience acclaim with its finale episode recording an 18.8% nationwide audience share, and garnered an average nationwide rating of 12.4%. 4. Sky Castle. This satirical drama revolves around four housewives residing in the exclusive residential area of Sky Castle. Ruthlessly ambitious, the women will stop at nothing to get their children into Seoul National University. It aired on JTBC from November 23, 2018 to February 1, 2019. Sky Castle garnered an average nationwide rating of 12.5%. 3. Goblin. A romantic fantasy drama starring Gong Yu in the title role with Kim Go Eun. It was shown on the cable network TVN from December 2, 2016 to January 21, 2017. The series follows the story of a 939-year-old goblin, also known as the Protector of Souls, as he ends up falling for the girl destined to end his cursed immortal life. The series recorded an average nationwide ratings of 12.9%. 2. Mr. Sunshine. The series is set in Hansung, the former name of Seoul in the early 1900s, and focuses on activists fighting for Korea's independence. The series aired on TVN starting from July 7, 2018, and ended on September 30, 2018. It premiered internationally on Netflix. Mr. Sunshine recorded the sixth highest ratings for cable television with its final episode reaching 18.129% and netting an average rating of 13%. 1. The World of the Married. It tells a story of a married couple whose betrayal of one another leads to a whirlwind of revenge, grief and healing. It aired on JTBC from March 27 to May 16, 2020. The World of the Married is the highest rated drama in Korean cable television history. With its final episode reaching a nationwide rating of 28.37%. It also recorded the highest average rating for a drama on cable television, with an average rating of 18.83%. These are the shows that proved to be a huge hit to viewers in Korea. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button below and clicking the bell icon to be notified whenever we publish a new video. Thank you for watching.